Welcome to our YouTube channel, me Madan. Today, I'm going to tell you about Microsoft Windows 11. Nowadays, maximum laptop and PC cannot install Windows 11. I will show the process. What is the system requirement of Windows 11 and how we can install Windows 11 from the beginning. Do not forget to watch this video till the end. And do not forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel. You can see here the AMD Ryzen 5 3500U with Redon BGA Mobile GFX 2.10 GHz. What will show the Google the requirement of Windows 11 you can check here in Google Windows 11 SYSTEM 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 requirement you can see here 1 gigahertz for faster with two or more core it means core i3 core i5 or core 2 dual RAM should be 4 GB and storage size should be 64 GB 64 GB minimum this is the minimum requirement and the main important thing is here the system firmware UFI secure boot capable click here for more information suppose we will click, click here enable go to setting update security recovery and restart now under advanced start, start up the next screen select a troubleshoot advanced option UFI framework setting restart to make sense TPM trusted platform module TPM means trusted platform module which is explained here now how we can check the trusted platform model it means TPM just press windows and R key type T -P TPM dot M S C and then press enter now you can check here what is the TPM of this laptop or my PC completable trusted platform model TPM can be found on the computer verify that the computer has a 1.2 TPM or a letter and it is turned on the BIOS now we have to go BIOS and then after BIOS we can change the TPM format first of all start and power then restart now the system is going to restart restart anyway after that this one is a SPPC that's why I press escape key now F10 BIOS setup I will press F10 from here and you can see here security we can go security and then you can see here the TPM device you can see here TPM device what is shown here hidden you have to press enter here and then select available and then TPM state enter enable and clear TPM no if you press yes then it will clear all TPM if you, if you press no then it will not clear anything if I press yes then make it yes it means it is the authority and then press F10 here and then press enter now your BIOS TPM will be changed wait for a while while the PC is going to restart what is saying here the following configuration change was a request for those computers trust platform model TPM clear TPM warning clearing the TPM erase information store on TPM you will lose all created keys and access to data encrypted by the keys press F1 for accept and press 2 for reject 
there is no any data in our TPM so that I will press F1. Now it's going to be restart again. Now you can check here. I'll put the password of this PC and I will check TPM now. How to check TPM? Windows R and then TPM dot MSC. You can check here. The TPM is 3.30 sorry 3.34.044 the specification version is 2.0 it means we can install windows 11 on this laptop now thank you very much for watching this video please do not forget to like share and subscribe my channel thank you